1978 release of Live and Dangerous secured Thin Lizzy's status as rock icons. It became the biggest selling Lizzy album of all time, shifting over half a million copies in the UK alone. Live and Dangerous, of course, is still regarded as the definitive double live record. It's hard to disagree with that. There's a Live and Dangerous album, which has been voted greatest live album of all time, which it probably is. When uh, Live and Dangerous was made, uh, just after it, was, it became a hit, Phil came back and to do a gig at the Bag It In in Dublin, and everybody wanted to get in, and everybody wanted an interview. And uh, after the gig, he had said nobody into the dressing room, and I sneaked in with my tape recorder. And um, he looked at me and he kicked the tape recorder up in the air and he said, my life's not one long bleeding interview, you know? <laughs> uh, but we had a great laugh about it afterwards. <laughs> After Live and Dangerous, 